Number 21. Have you seen Shelly recently? The last time I spoke to her, she said she hadn't been feeling too well. Well, when I saw her this morning, she was the picture of health. What does the man say about Shelly? Number 22. Everyone's getting a little impatient. Can't we call this meeting to order? Once Lou gets here, we can. What does the man mean? Number 23. Marianne, are you going to buy those sunglasses you looked at? I wouldn't buy that pair even if I could afford them. What does Mary Ann say about the sunglasses? Number 24. You can't expect to become a tennis pro after just a few lessons, Ken. I shouldn't have had such high hopes, I suppose. What did Ken probably expect? Number 25. We only have a few more points to talk over. Good, because I need to wrap this up soon. What does the man want to do? Number 26. Can I help you? I'd just like a couple of books of matches, please. What does the man mean? Number 27. Should I take California Street or Oak Street to get downtown? What difference does it make? It's the same distance no matter how you go. What does the woman mean? Number 28. Did you hear the announcement? Yes, and I could hardly believe my ears. What does the woman imply about the announcement? Number 29. Brian, could you handle this suitcase too? How many hands do you think I have? What does Brian mean? Number 30. I'm so glad I can go camping this weekend. Then you don't have to study for that physics test after all? What had the man originally thought about the woman? This is the end of Part A. Go on to Part B.